always tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. A genuine taste of spring out there today. High temperatures were able to soar into the 50s, more typical of what we see on April 1st, but no joke, it was definitely on the warmer end of average. Mostly sunny skies also with us today. Checking out those high temperatures from across the region, 50 in Grand Rapids, the high at 51 in Allegan and also Kalamazoo, 45 in South Haven today. The high temperature climbing all the way to 50 in Muskegon, 49 in Fremont and Greenville. So no doubt about it, it was very warm outside. It was only three degrees off of the record high from 1962 here in Grand Rapids. We do expect some patchy fog to develop tonight. Once that lifts, we should have a lot of sunshine on our Monday. A little bit cooler than today, but still comfortable in the low to mid 40s. And we'll streak together some more highs in the 40s and 50s. And we'll be close to record high temperatures again later on this week. There's the view outside of the Gerald R. Ford International Airport. Now things are pretty calm out there. The wind is about as calm as could be actually. 30 is the current temperature. The dew point stands at 22 and relative of humidity is now at 71 percent. Looking in on temperatures now, a blend of upper 20s and lower 30s. 33 in Sturgis, it's 32 degrees in Coldwater, checking in with 29 in Fremont. So a very comfortable night out there. These are more typical of high temperatures that are seen on February 4th versus those 50s that we saw this afternoon. The wind, just a whisper, it's out of the north, currently sustained at under five miles per hour for all locations. No big problems as far as visibility is concerned right now, though you can see that we have a reduction up in Lettington at this time. However, as we go through the next 24 hours, you can see that we will have some fog form. As we get into the morning hours of our Monday, could make for a tricky commute here and there. Not expecting to see too dense of fog, but even still, since the temperature will be below freezing, it could create some issues with ice being deposited on some roadways there with the freezing fog. Future cast as we get into Wednesday, that's when we should expect to reel in some more cloud cover. And it looks like as we get into Thursday evening, there is the potential of picking up on some rain showers. Hours. Those will be passing through from southwest to northeast. And it looks like we'll have a kind of wet start to our Friday also before that rain is expected to escape as we get into next weekend. But once the rain passes, it is going to be a little bit cooler, still well above average, but not quite as warm as what we're going to be witnessing through the coming days. Tonight, a low temperature of 26 is expected, patchy fog as we chill things down. Tomorrow, a high of 43, becoming sunny once we get rid of the fog. Here's your eight-day forecast, 50 on Wednesday, 50 52 Thursday. There you can see those rain chances assembling Thursday evening going into Friday. Friday still warm at 52. Then we'll see those temperatures descend some into next weekend. Lower to middle 40s and cloudy skies also making a comeback in the extended forecast. You may be wondering how those temperatures stack up versus average. Well, you can see the average high temperature just about the freezing point. Record high temperatures in the low to mid 50s, even 60 degrees on Thursday. And we're going to be close a couple days later this week. Amanda?